Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we will discuss one of the most important topic of Tableau that is context filter and then we will discuss what is the use case of context filter and things to remember while using context filter. So without any further delay, let's get started. So what is context filter? So whenever we use a context filter, Tableau create a temporary table out of the data and all the filter works based on context filter data. Okay, or you can say context filter as being independent filter and all the filters are worked as a dependent filter because they process only the data that passes through the context filter. Okay, so let's see how we can use context filter in Tableau. For this, we need to drag some fields from dragging customer name with sales and let's drag customer name in the filter and click on ok to make a filter as a context right click on it and add to context so when the color is changed to gray so it becomes context filter and to remove it from the context filter just right click on it and remove from context okay this is how you can create a context filter so what is the use of context filter suppose you need to find out top 10 customer okay so you can easily do it by just right click on it and edit filter go to top and select top 10 customer name with sales and just click on okay right so you will easily get so these are the top 10 customer with sales so what if you need to find out top 10 customer for each category right so when you drag this filter and show filter sorry click on show filter okay so it's showing it's still showing only 10 values right for all so what if i need top 10 customer for only for furniture or you can say top 10 customer only for office supplies or you can say technology okay so you can see the values are decreasing okay and we are not getting accurate result that we want let me make it to single value so that it will be clear for you okay so this is how we are getting values so for this we need to create this as a context filter so when we add a context filter we will get our exact values so when we see the values so we will get top 10 customer for furniture and top 10 customer for office supplies and top 10 customer for technology okay let's sort this so, so this is this, this look much better now so you can see these are the top 10 values so basically what happened is so first we added category as a context filter so when we add category as a context filter tableau create uh, temporary data set of our data suppose we have selected technology so all the uh, filters that we added then all gives the data based on technology okay so that's why we only get top 10 customer based on technology so if we select office supply the values are changed okay so this is the main use case of context filter let's discuss one more use case of context filter now i'm using different fields for this context filter example i'm dragging subcategory and profit and drag subcategory into filter and then click on and then find out top three subcategory okay these are the top three subcategories but let's sort these okay so, so now if you want to find out top three subcategory for each category just drag category to filter and make it to context filter and then show filter okay make it to single list so you can see the values are changed so so these are the top three subcategory for furniture and these are the top three subcategories for 
office supplies and these are three subcategories for technology okay so you need to remember few things to make use of context filter in a better way so first thing is use a single context filter so try to pick up a single context filter that reduce the size of the data set rather than adding multiple context filter or you can say if the filter is not reducing the size by one tenth or more then uh, we should not consider to add a filter into context filter because it will impact the performance of your dashboard okay so try to pick up a single filter to add into context filter that reduce the size of the data okay second is set up context filter before adding fields because as we know when we add a filter into context filter tableau create a temporary data set out of data and data size reduce okay so if you add fields before adding to context filter then you will load all the data fields and then if you add context filter so tableau need to recompute all the value and it will impact the performance of your dashboard so try to set up context filter before adding fields and third one is complete all your data modeling before creating a context filter changing in the data model like suppose uh, you want to convert a field into dimension to measure and measure to dimension so it will take to recomputing the context filter and it will impact the performance of your dashboard so make sure uh, you should complete all your data modeling before making a filter to context filter okay if you remember all these things the performance of the dashboard will increase and you will use context filter in a better way so these are the some benefits of context filter context filter is an independent filter and all the other filters used becomes dependent filter context filter gives faster result context filter improve performance and by using context filter we can easier to reach granular level and context filter shows only relevant data thank you so much guys if you like the video please do like share and subscribe and stay tuned for upcoming videos